In this video, we'll look at the largest predatory bird ever, the shark you'd be glad is extinct, and the major beef between T-Rex and Megacroc. But let us begin with the king of the crawlers. Fans of Jurassic World believe that T-Rexes were the most terrifying creatures ever to walk the earth. So how about we start with one to get our Jurassic juice running today? One of the world's most deadly predators gets the nod. They were appropriately called King of the Tyrant Lizards, as they were formed by nature to rule the earth. Tyrannosaurus rexes were one of the most ferocious predators to have ever walked the earth, with a gigantic bulk, keen fangs, and jaws capable of crushing a car in seconds. During the late Cretaceous period, 68 million years ago, the legendary carnivore from Jurassic World controlled the forested river valleys of western North America. T-Rexes had a massive body that stretched 40 feet from their snout to the tip of their formidable tail, about the size of a large school bus, and they weighed up to 8 tons. Let's not confine ourselves just to the surface. Instead, let us explore the depths, as there's still so much inside the ocean that mankind has yet to discover, and there was a lot that went extinct. Megalodon is the world's largest and most dangerous carnivore, making the great white shark look like a goldfish in comparison. Megalodon fossils first appeared 20 million years ago. The gigantic shark controlled the oceans for the following 13 million years, until it went extinct only 3.6 million years ago. The jaws of this gigantic shark would have put any other jaws to shame. The next one is one of the most terrifying sea creatures I've ever heard of. The 35-foot-long beast resembled a turtle, with the exception that its neck was enlarged to the size of a school bus. Its name is Plesiosaurus thalassomedon, which means sea king in Greek. And I have no doubt that this fearsome creature dominated the seas. Contrary to its name, plesiosaurs ate small food like fish and soft-bodied invertebrates due to their small size and grabbing teeth. It entirely vanished from the waters during the late Cretaceous period, which makes me glad. Next on our list is Androsarchus mongoliensis. They were the world's largest known meat-eating land mammal and were native to China's Inner Mongolian region. In 2017, a magnificent skull of a massive beast almost three feet long with enormous jaws was discovered in the area. The beast was given the name of Androsarchus mongoliensis, and it is still the only specimen of the species, which lived 45 million years ago. Despite the fact that only its skull has ever been discovered, experts conclude from the size of the skull and evolutionary ties with other species that Androsarchus was roughly 6 feet tall at the shoulder and 12 feet long, making it the largest known meat-eating land mammal to ever exist. Next, we have the Forest Racidae, or terror birds, who could crush skulls with their beaks, and all you could have to get from these birds was certain death. If these enraged birds had been around today, they would have smashed human heads like melons. They were 10 feet tall and inhabited North and South America up until 2 million years ago. These wicked birds' beaks were so strong, sharp, and powerful that they could kill other animals just by striking them in the head. Imagine a swarm of such birds in our area. Thank God they're no longer here. As if they were waiting for T-Rexes to vanish, the period of Titanoboa, the 50-foot snakes as apex predators, began just after dinosaurs became extinct. It was the world's largest crawling animal. The gigantic snakes were around 50 feet long, weighed 2,500 pounds, and used constriction to kill their prey. They were non-venomous, like modern-day anacondas, but their enormous size and powerful bulk possessed the constricting powers of three Eiffel Towers stacked on top of each other. Just look at this nightmarish animal. Paleontologists and scientists dubbed them buzzsaw killers, and if you're wondering why, consider this. It was a shark with a circular saw of razor-sharp teeth as its lower jaw. Helicoprion was a 9 to the 13 foot long dinosaur that lived 290 million years ago. Unlike other sharks, this one did not shed its teeth and instead developed them into a wheel-like pattern within the lower jaw, 
Helicoprion became a buzzsaw killer and gained a sense of intimidation as its deadly whirl grew. The legendary Tylosaurus Mosasaur feeding show from the Jurassic Park movie will undoubtedly ring some bells in your head. Yeah, you read it correctly. It was the largest Mosasaur to ever live, and it was even bigger than the mighty Megalodon. Mosasaurus was an aquatic squamate reptile that lived between 82 and 66 million years ago and was discovered to be 14.2 to 15.3 meters long with a possible weight of more than 30 tons, which is bad news for Megalodon fans because Mosasaurus was longer than Megalodon. And even worse news for dinosaur fans because these ferocious beasts were scarier than dinosaurs. Real life Bigfoots used to roam portions of Asia particularly the tropical rainforests of China, until roughly 100,000 years ago. They were the world's largest ape, and if they hadn't got extinct, they would have been regarded as true Bigfoots. They are the forefathers of modern apes, standing nearly 10 feet tall and weighing around 1,100 pounds. Their diets were mostly vegetarian. However, the males of the species had an arm span of around 12 feet, and an armed exchange between these apes could have terrified you to death. T-Rexes and other fierce dinosaurs were natural enemies of Dinosuchus, also known as the Mega Croc, Super Croc, or Horrible Croc. Both species' fossil records reveal bite marks, indicating that they fought each other on a regular basis. This Super Croc, whose size rivaled that of today's largest crocs, was more than capable of destroying a fully grown dinosaur. They were discovered in North America and may have grown to be 35 feet long. This crocodilian species once ruled the ecology, but has since become extinct. Although T-Rex and Megacroc were mortal foes, if they had ever decided to live together and have a love child, the result would have been Caprosuchus saharicus. They were a group of extinct, enormous reptiles that looked like crocodiles, but had long legs to run, and you would not have been able to outrun them if they were still around today. Their bones were discovered in Nigeria, and they were thought to be 20 feet long upright meat-eater reptiles with an armored snout for ramming and three sets of dagger-shaped fangs for slicing flesh. Caprosuchus adapted well to both marine and terrestrial environments. Dunkelosteus grew up to 30 feet long and lived 360 million years ago. This was a monstrous fish that could chew through its prey's bones like jelly. It had a beak-like mouth and was extensively armored. Its mouth appeared to be designed expressly for biting and piercing through armor similar to its own, implying that this species of fish may have engaged in cannibalism or fought over territory. Their jaws were so quick to open and close that they could hinge them open and close in milliseconds. I thank God these fish are no longer alive today. Megacroc and T-Rexes have a land competition, as I previously stated. It's now time for a water battle between Liviatan and Megalodon. Liviatan is one of the world's largest predators, with a length of 57 feet and a weight of 50 tons, as well as the world's longest biting teeth of 1.2 feet. It was a powerful predator who despised Megalodon, and Megalodon himself was not a huge admirer of Liviatan. This beast roamed the planet some 15 million years ago with 18 inch long beaks and tremendous speed on land. Is it a bird, a chicken, or an ostrich? No, it's a killing cat, which lived long after the dinosaurs had all gone extinct. Still, you wouldn't want one of these things hunting you. And now, let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by one of our subscribers. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it on over to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Existing around 390 million years ago, these massive predators named Jacolopterus reneniae roamed the sea, murdering everything in their path. With many limbs and an unending instinct to eat, these sea scorpions dwarfed anything else in the water, tearing their prey apart piece by piece. Coming across a Jacolopterus would have been a terrifying experience. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. 
subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.